the magazine has named you the coolest villain ever. How do you feel with the title? Who said that? GQ magazine. Really? What do you want on the cover? Hmm. The coolest villain. The coolest villain. Thank yeah. you, GQ. On James Bond. Thank you. Yeah, well, it's for them to say, not for me. <laughs> being twice an Oscar winner, did you hesitate being in Bond film? No. One doesn't have anything to do with the, not, with, with the other. Um, winning an Oscar doesn't mean that you have to stop working. Um, for some it does, um, yes. unfortunately. But um, um, I, I, I just, you know, I get on with it. I, I do what I do. And um, I can't think too much about past glory, nor can I think too much about future glory, because what, what happens in between? Because that's what I'm responsible for, the bit in between. Every character you play seems to dominate you. I mean, how you built it, the latest one on Bond film? I, I just let it take over a little bit. You know, I, I don't build consciously too much. I mean, I, I, I think about it, but yes. um, not every thought you have is building. And then, you know, an actor is just one little element in, in the, the, the movie making process. And it, in the end, what you see is the sum total. How is to achieve success later in your life? It's, um, you know, it's pretty good. Um, it's... Uh, it, it comes at the right moment. Um, it's, it doesn't, it doesn't um, tempt me into um, thinking that it's all because of me. Yes. You know, or what I've done. I know pretty well how it comes together. And so it's, it's, it's quite satisfying because it opens opportunities at a time when actually opportunities start to wane or not close down but sort of uh, uh, diminish a little bit in as much as they go into a very specific direction whereas when you're young you know the world is open yes or so you think what is the motivating force behind your career i mean your personality making a living thank you so much